Hey everyone and welcome to the SANA Commerce demo. In this video tutorial I will tell you about item groups and product categories in Microsoft Dynamics AX that are used to group the products of the catalog. In AX you can classify products using item groups and product categories. By default SANA Commerce uses item groups. To create and manage the item groups in AX click Inventory Management, Setup, Inventory, Item groups. Well, here you can create item groups. Item groups can be used to create a single level navigation. Under the Setup Fast tab, use the Visible in Webshop checkbox to show or hide the item group in the webshop. If you make the item group invisible, products assigned to this item group will be still visible, only the item groups become invisible in the webshop. Using translations, you can add item group description in different languages. When the item groups are created, you can assign products to the appropriate item groups. On the Release Product Details form, under the Manage Costs Fast tab, select the item group to which the product should belong. Item group is a required field of a product. So, no matter whether you are going to use item groups or product categories to classify the products of your catalog, item groups should be still created and specified per product. And now let's talk about product categories. In AX, click Product Information Management, Setup, Categories, Category Hierarchies. Well, here you can create and manage category hierarchy. As you can see, you can use category hierarchy to create multi-level navigation, unlike item groups that allow to create only single-level navigation. When you create category nodes, you need to enter the name of the node, and also friendly name as this one is shown in the web store as the name of the navigation item. Use the visible in webshop checkbox to show or hide the product category node in the webshop. If you make the category node of a higher level invisible, all subnodes will be also invisible. Using translations, you can add the name of the category node in different languages. When everything is ready, do not forget to activate the category hierarchy. It is also possible to add product attributes to the product category that can be used for products filtering in the web store and to add product specifications. To be able to add product attributes, you need to associate the category hierarchy with the procurement category hierarchy type. To assign products to a certain category node, open the Release Products table, select the product and click Product Categories. This way you can assign the product to a certain category hierarchy and category node. If you want to use product categories instead of item groups, you should enable product categories in the Webshops table. Under the Product Information Management Fast tab, enable Product Categories and select the Category Hierarchy. By default, Product Categories are disabled and the item groups are used. If you enable Product Categories, this will require product reindexing. You should open SANA Admin, click Tools, Schedule Tasks and rebuild the index by running the Product Import task. In SANA Admin, Click Setup, ERP Integration, Item Categories. Whether you are using item groups or product categories in Microsoft Dynamics AX to classify products, you can import them into SANA Admin to automatically build the main menu for your web store with the products catalog. That's it for this demo. Thank you for watching.